Here are a bunch of chords. Sounds pretty involved, but I'm only playing three chords, either G, C, or D. There's one chord shape that's allowing me to do this. Here's a standard G chord, and then here's this. This is B, G, and D on the A string, D string, and B strings. Listen to these two. Sounds like I'm changing chords. I'm actually not. This is G, and so is this. The only difference is the order of the notes, in particular the bass note, which is not G. It is B, G's third, which is why I call this a three bass chord. This different order gives the illusion that the chords are changing, but they're not, giving you this involved sound while keeping the actual chords pretty simple. So once you memorize this shape, remember, this note is not the root, it's the third. The root is actually the pinky, or you can simply look here on the E string. So if this is G, go to its third. So is that. If this is A, go to its third. So is that. If this is B, go to its third. So is that.